Hello sellers, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to Tarotella. This is my original channel for international artists, celebrities, and idols. Well, um, I hope that you subscribe if you're new to see more of the psychic readings of your favorite actors and actresses and idols, singers, whoever that you'd like me to read. Um, of course, you can comment down the names of your favorite celebrities on the comment section box and I'll try to acknowledge them. And the most re requested ones are going to be granted. Okay, so today we're going to have a reading for Ji Chang Wook. Well, he's like the oppa that's, you know, like overall oppa for me. <laughs> I have a huge crush on Ji Chang Wook and he's actually my number one favorite um, actor in South Korea. And he recently had his birthday, so if you haven't greeted him, happy birthday, please greet him, belated happy birthday in his Instagram. So we're going to read for his career and his love life as I cleanse um, this deck, okay? I actually already cleansed them before this video, but um, without any further ado, let's start. Um, God, guys, angels, like angels, universe, ancestors, and Holy Spirit, please give us the overall energy of Ji Chang's showbiz life, career, project, the overall energy of his career at this time, at this moment. Okay, the dream. Wow, there's lots of ambitions and lots of plans. Lots of projects that's upcoming for Ji Chang Wook. I'm very, very proud of him. Um, you know what? I, I have I have to say that I've been a big fan of Ji Chang Wook ever since I saw him in the um, I forgot the the name of the K drama, but it was the very first time that I saw him. It's not the healer. That was his breakthrough. I believe that he is just um a supporting actor in that K drama, which is I forgot, <laughs> and I've been um, a fan since, like, for already seven years or so, something like that, already seven years, and I am very frustrated with the K two K drama because he really, really worked hard for that. I'm very disappointed that he, he didn't receive um, any recognition, like a Best Actor award or um, particularly that K-drama supposed to be like, you know, um, a big breakthrough, but it didn't receive much recognition. Even Yuna did her very best in the K-2. And even Ji Chang Wook, he, he trained in the mixed martial arts or Muay Thai. I'm just very disappointed that the K-2 didn't get so much recognition, which is very, you know, they're very deserving, especially for Ji Chang Wook because he did a lot of stunts there. Most of that was like there's no other uh, stunt man to help them. I think a little, but you know, um, as a credible actor, I should say that um, most of the stunts was Ji Chang Wook. Okay, he did it all by himself. And this dream is particularly um, like a, re a, a reminder for me that. He has a big dreams for his life, for his career, and for his mother, of course. He's been dream daydreaming about so many things recently, and that is including his next projects. Maybe um, his dreams are manifesting at this time. We all know that he kind of like Lilo in action K-drama or action film. Maybe he wants romantic comedy K-drama. And he wants to play someone who is cocky, funny, and charming, and you know, kind of light drama. He has a lot of aspirations and ideals in his mind that is actually manifesting right now in his life, which is a good sign. Universe, what's going to be the overall energy of Ji Chang Wook's love life? Is he dating? Is there any potential that he wants to date somebody? Is he attracted to somebody at this time? Give us an insight about his love life. Ji Chang Wook's love life. The return. Mm, that's quite 
unexpected. This oracle or overall energy of Ji Chang-wook in uh, the context of his love life, the return is kind of like coming back to where he started. Maybe his feelings for somebody is all coming back to him. A resurrection of dead feelings, yeah. And remembering what happened in the past, um, you know, he's been linked to so many women, like a lot of women actually, in the showbiz industry, and none of that was confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> at his age you know none of that was confirmed um, he's very secretive in his private life this time the universe is telling us that there is like an old feeling that's coming back to him maybe he has some regrets of letting go of that person or not being really well committed to that person because none of those speculations or rumors were true about Ji Chang Wook dating this woman and that woman and whomever because this is something that is in his past already but he keeps remembering the past happenings maybe this is like emotional attachment to him he's still communicating with the person or an ex secret ex girlfriend <laughs> if he has one but he never confirmed but he didn't say no that I didn't have an ex in the show business so but I don't know <laughs> you know it's, he's very very mysterious type and that's why I'm very drawn to Ji Chang Wook he's my number one crush in South Korea like oh anyway okay let's take a look at more insight about the dream and the return universe God guys angels like angels universe ancestors and Holy Spirit Please give us more insight about the dream and the return. What is the link between the dream and the return energies of his career right at this moment and the future outcome? Okay, so let's see. Let's see. Ji Chang Wook's love life and the return. Tell us more about the return in the context of his love life. Alright, so let's see. The Queen of Pentacles. The Queen of Wands. Three of Swords. King of Wands. Okay. So definitely, he has so many daydreaming about this person with the Queen of Pentacles and the Queen of Wands. These two queens, Queen of Pentacles and Queen of Wands, could possibly be a one person. And he has like a broken relationship with this person. The Queen of Pentacles is someone who is very practical with the money, very um, charming, very loving, very um, well-mannered. Um, someone who is wise in spending money, someone who's generous with the heart and um, someone who's always having that um, grace and gratitude and the Queen of Wands is very passionate, driven, intelligent, um, well organized, someone who is very creative and this is the kind of woman he is attracted to and the King of Wands, I feel like this is him so the woman that he's thinking about is a fire sign, Iris uh, Sagittarius and Leo and this represents him the king of wands um, I'm very surprised to see this king of wands because I, I, I see him in this quality of the king of wands he's very passionate you know that he grew up without his father and he did everything he can to survive and I mean with his mother of course to survive and to thrive in his career but I see this as there's a blockage there's still a pain inside him maybe um, he's seeing this person because they have you know they, they live in the in the same world you know they live in the same world of showbiz industry of course and this person could be uh, someone who's very popular in South Korea as I see it very creative type of person passionate and 
his feelings towards this this person has not yet subside it's, it's still there because there is the return and the pain or the longing is still there the three of swords he's still thinking about what happened in the past so this is the probably the reason the logical reason why we have the return here because he still can't get over it oh see ten of wands there is a fire sign that's involved in his life okay oh i dropped the card so let me just get it all right what we have here we have the ten of swords <sighs> oh my god this is really heartbreaking for for Jichang. five of swords and then king of swords oh wow this is like a huge burden to him like this is all together like the queen of pentacles and the ten of wands here okay um i see that this woman is someone who is he truly admire someone who truly truly admire and it's giving him some mental turmoil like there's the pain still the pain is recurring to him maybe he's probably having that trust issue to date once again because this woman has a huge impact in his life and whether it's um a public relationship or a secret because i've never seen him with any women before in the showbiz industry so the ten of swords represent his you know the lingering feeling is still there as we can see that the return um energy of his love life is very relevant because if the pain still lingers the breakup still you know he's still reminiscing the breakup with this person and probably there's a conflict um he wasn't able to win the heart of that person to come back and he feels so defeated and you know i don't think there's a reconciliation that's gonna come but he is trying his best to handle it like a man you know he, he's trying his best to handle it maturely and responsibly with the king of swords so he is letting go of that person already but the emotion is still lingers in his heart and his mind because he still think about that this, this woman you know this woman i feel like i said earlier that the queen of pentacles and the queen of wands i feel that this is the character of the woman that he is admiring or someone he dearly love and um let's see more of his career anything that's positive in his career hello travelers support is all around you wow reaching your destination your light is shining brightly definitely because you know the, the k drama that um just recently uh, just a recent project of ji chan wook is very fun they have a um i mean I, I like his character being quirky one overcoming obstacles you can overcome anything definitely because i feel like this is an emotional obstacle for him to date somebody else because Chi Chang Wook as a loyal person just can't easily get over that person whoever that is I feel like this woman is in showbiz industry the queen of pentacles and the queen of wands this woman who is very independent independent minded and very passionate very creative so let us see more about his love life universe what else can you say about the return energy okay forgiving and learning see as you release and heal the past you experience more love in your present moments hmm. a huge burden for him maybe the breakup is very <laughs> traumatizing <laughs> some somehow okay this could be the one Mm -hmm. this person could be the one for him but it didn't work out 
trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Maybe he wants to reconcile back with this person and the universe is telling him to have faith that there is a way you know the universe can give him a way to be with this person once again and i feel like he thinks that this person is the one for him i mean he wouldn't feel this way like there's a burden and mental turmoil see this the ten of wands and the ten of swords definitely this is a sign that he's been thinking this person recently and over and over again he wants to return and come back together again okay this is the reason why he thinks that this woman is the one for him already but there is something that happened and he needs to let go of the grudges somebody needs to let go of the grudges forgive and learn that people make mistakes as well and trust this way this situation is calling for you to have faith so the universe is telling him that trust in the divine and the universe will bless you with a reconciliation that you need in your relationship because i feel like he's been doing a lot of things ten of wands and it's been a burden for him to make up with this person really like a burden so much burden and because there is a conflict and argument that feels like there's no way we can work this out something like that the five of swords but he's doing a lot of things like making some effort with the king of swords right here that's the reading for ji chang wook i hope that you enjoy this um psychic reading for ji chang wook so again this is a general reading for ji chang wook this may not resonate with him 100 percent but um if you know anything um that's relevant to what we read right here please let me know and comment down below and don't forget to subscribe here in my channel and also if you're a filipino and you have a shopee app i'm already open for private readings you can purchase my private readings and the link is on the description box and if you have any comments of your favorite celebrities and idols you can comment down their names in the comment section box and i'll try to acknowledge them okay so be patient because there's a lot of requests that's coming um and i'll see you next time sellers love and light bye